So rewind six months and here we are in Fortaventura. Um, I never uploaded this, this is so old now. We went in September of last year, but I thought it was still good to upload it and show you guys what we got up to. So this was one of the days I went to Coralejo and just me and Eddie went for the day here. We were going away with family and yeah, we took ourselves off for the day basically. I didn't really vlog the trip and um, I decided to have quite a chilled approach to to vlogging and stuff and taking photos, just needed to take a bit of time out really. But um, it had a really good vibe about the place and I just got my camera out and started filming. So we did a bit of shopping, we got there, got ice cream, looked at just drinks and stuff like that you've already seen in the video. Um, yeah, the shopping was really cool. This strip was really cool with all different restaurants, really like this. I'd say the only thing is, Fortaventura is really quite touristy. Um, it's not somewhere that I've ever thought about going before. Um, it's kind of a bit of a oh should we try here like the canary islands are really lovely and everything so we thought it'd be good oh i love this part of it so this is a hotel that i was saying to Eddie, can we come back and stay here with all the blue like the shutters and everything looks so gorgeous i uh, love the little alcove sort of beach area oh and this place i don't even know what this was i think it was just stood empty but i can't even imagine having you know like a room in there would be amazing so this is a little kind of bar cafe that we found, uh, really near to the beach and the waterfront which was gorgeous and they did really really good sort of like pincho, like tapas style stuff. So me and Eddie sat here for most of the afternoon actually um, and Eddie kind of, kind of got through quite a lot of the different pinchos that they had. Obviously it was bread so I couldn't really have much of it but they have different salads um, and all of those were pretty much gluten free so I had a lot of choice. Uh, yeah. I'm looking a bit sweaty there, let's be honest. <laughs> so we sat outside and had a couple of beers. That looks like a stein actually, Ed, wow. Um, and yeah, well, that's what it was called. It was called Gilda and yeah, that was Eddie's bottle actually, it wasn't gluten free, but I thought the design was very cool. Um, so there was some of Eddie's food, yep, yeah, from all angles. Don't know, I filmed it about a million different ways. <laughs> uh, yeah, so it was really, really sunny and gorgeous. It was just nice just to sit out and chill and just explore somewhere completely new. So this is the sort of seafront, it had lots of rock pool areas. Um, yeah, it was just generally really quite beautiful there and just a tiny area. The whole of the island actually was um, so like barren. There was no wildlife. Um, it just was kind of like the place that, it just like it was kind of burnt to a crisp and there was not much life there, but obviously they've made it, like I said, really quite touristy and a lot of people go to the Canary Islands on their summer holidays each year. So it's cool to explore somewhere new. Am I near the end of the video? I think I am. So I'll speak to you all soon. Bye!